Welcome back, y'all, and today I thought since Halloween is just around the corner, we could check out some spooky, creepy Halloween set-up aquariums. If you're anything like me, you want your fish to enjoy Halloween decorations as much as we do. So without further ado, let's check out some creepy, spooky fish tanks. So first up, we've got a nice tank with some skulls and purple and orange fake plants. Nothing too crazy or over the top here, but not too bad. Not too bad. Next up, I really like the idea of this as a decoration, but not so much for a fish tank. It is creepy, it is spooky, but not exactly appropriate for fish. But if you did just use this as a decoration and didn't keep any fish in it, it might actually be pretty cool. Next up, I absolutely love this tank. It looks like a creepy haunted forest. I did review a tank that was very similar to this and I absolutely love this like backlit looking style tank with all the creepy branches. It does, it just looks like a haunted forest and I love it. One of my tanks is gonna end up getting scaped like this if I ever get around to setting up my fish rack. And here we have a tank reminiscent of The Walking Dead. You gotta love a decapitated zombie head in an aquarium. Is it really a Halloween tank if you don't have a decapitated head in it? I mean, really. Next up, I would love this if it was just a light fixture, not so much as a fish tank. It is not appropriate to use as a fish tank, but but if this was just a lamp, I would absolutely love it. Fish tank, not so much. Not so much. Not appropriate. And next, better watch out, looks like we got zombies coming out of the ground. I love these tanks. I do. I really do. I need, I need some zombies to add to my fish tanks. And here it looks like we've got an underwater view of Crystal Lake complete with Jason. Wouldn't want to be around when he uh, breaks that chain. And next we have a betta entering the graveyard. I love that even the betta looks very, very Halloween. Very Halloween. I love that color. I love the colors on this betta. I need this fish. I need an orange and black betta. And here it looks like we've got another zombie coming back from the grave. I really love these tanks. I love the zombie tanks. It almost looks big enough that it could be a life-size, life-size body. They're coming to get you, Barbara. Next, we got a little bit more kid-style Halloween tank with the super colorful gravel, the happy little pumpkin, and it looks like a little man-eating plant we got going on in here. My kid would absolutely love this tank. My kid would definitely love this tank. Me, I'm at a point where I prefer a little bit more creepy, spooky when it comes to Halloween-themed fish tanks. And when I came across this, I almost died laughing. This is not an actual fish tank, but it is a fish tank costume. I love this idea. I love this idea of a fish tank costume. That's like the best thing ever. It doesn't look like it'd be very easy to walk around in or very comfortable, but oh my gosh. Would it be wrong to make my kid go for Halloween as a fish tank? Would it? would it so anyway guys that's all i really have for y'all today as always thank you so so much for watching i love you guys and i will see you in my next video bye